Hello everybody. Last year I wrote a short article about some of the programming projects I had done that year and I thought I would do the same this year but in video format. So yeah. Okay, so onto my GitHub where I'm going to show you some of my hobby projects that I've done this year. Starting with Vengeful Vineyard, which is super cool. Check this out. Okay, this is Vengeful Vineyard. So uh, all the text is in Norwegian, but uh, short story is that this is an application that is going to be used by... Uh, oops, something is bugged. Fuck it. This is an application that is going to be used by uh, some students at my school, MTNU. And it's a way to keep track of who owes who beer. So, okay, here it tries to render some images. It doesn't work. But anyways, the design, simple, clean. Looks good, right? This is my favorite part of it. The emoji picker. It's so satisfying. Let's put a fire emoji. Let's remove my heart emoji here. And let's put up a school emoji. So yeah, that's that project. This is created using... <laughs> Okay, maybe I should have checked this before the demo. Somebody has been doing some changes, but anyways, this is created using uh, React for the front end and uh, just a standard norm core stack with Tailwind CSS. And actually, a lot of the components from this has been uh, created using Tailwind UI, which uh, we have access to. So uh, yeah, it's been fun uh, working on this and I hope uh, we can start using it soon. Okay, so that was Vengeful Vineyard. Then we have Giraffe Demo. Okay, this one is sick. So I tried creating a game in Godot and this is my, uh, my attempt at that. So I've gotten quite far and learned uh, quite a bit. And uh, actually the last thing I did was I made it multiplayer friendly. So you can actually create a game or join a game. So right now I guess I'll host one. Okay, so we are currently in game. You see that we play as uh, giraffes and the objective is simple. You are supposed to go up to some NPCs, then it's suddenly a type racer. Then you kill them. And my idea is that you are going to go around and type race like actual uh, people. But yeah, as of right now, the game is super bugged. And uh, yeah, the graphics created by me, or that's a lie. Uh, the giraffe graphic is created by me <laughs> and uh, yeah it's been super fun i really hope i get more time uh, to work on this project next year so i can actually finish it and uh, yeah maybe i can even create a video on it it's uh, been fun learning this stuff and it's just so bugged out right now but you know what i'm happy with it okay so that was godot next up we have uh, Gesucht. Okay, this one is a good project. Okay, so when moving to Berlin, you have to find a place to live, right? And most people, including me, use this website, vegegesucht.de. Now, the problem is that the housing market in Berlin is completely fucked up. It's so difficult finding a place, which is why I created this bot that automates the entire process for me and it even uses uh, the open ai api and uses gpt 3.5 to generate uh, some gpt responses now the bot sent super detailed messages and uh, the responses were also very good wow that was the most engaging text i've gotten till now and actually the place i'm living in right now this very room is found using this bot so yeah that was that project and uh, I actually went to this uh, hack and tell in Berlin at the uh, Seabase and uh, yeah, here, I won uh, the hack of the month for showing off this project. So uh, that was also very cool. And uh, yeah, shout out to Seabase and very, very fun. You should go there if you ever stop by Berlin. Then next up we have Cyberscape. Okay, so this is a lively and fun Hugo theme for creating personal websites. Now, actually, I didn't create this this year. I built this uh, sometime uh, last year, <laughs> but uh, I just found this project on my GitHub and I thought like, hmm, okay, maybe I should try publishing this to the Hugo themes. And as of right now, it's published. And uh, if you are uh, looking to create a fun Hugo website, you should use my theme. Here it is, Cyberscape. So yeah, feel free to check that out. Okay, then we are closing in. This is second to last, isaac.me, my website. 
I got a new domain this year. I'm super stoked on it. I got the domain Isaac.me, which I think is pretty cool. So I've been actively looking for a shorter domain. Previously, I had one that was five characters. Now I'm down to four. And I also really like the .me uh, TLD. So I'm very happy with this. And uh, yeah, this is how it looks right now. I It had a lot more content on it before, but... I recently just like nuked everything and uh, yeah, that's pretty much how it goes with this website. There's a lot of uh, changes being made all of the time and uh, I just find it very fun to to uh, play with. So yeah, right now this whole website is built using Astro, which I've been really liking this year. And speaking of Astro, we have the last project uh, for this year, which is Dreamscape, which is my new blog that I'm uh, doing. So uh, this is currently running at blog.isaac.me. I hope I don't change this anytime soon, so this will stay relevant. But yeah, I rewrote uh, my entire blog and changed uh, the design of it a bit. So right now it has this very clean, nice layout and it's been so nice uh, creating this again using Astro and also got a different code section with some tags you can see here you can go into the technical articles if you want you can read about me and yeah it's pretty much as uh, basic as uh, you can get it but uh, i'm happy with it and uh, i don't really think i'll be changing this much for the coming year so yeah if you're interested in checking out uh, my blog and what i write currently written two things on it check it out you can subscribe by RSS or just check out the website once in a while. Should be good. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. Uh, other than that, I guess work and school as well. Now, next year I'm finishing school. I'm getting my bachelor's degree, hopefully, if I manage to uh, pass all of my courses. But uh, once that is done, I think I'll have so much more time to program on the side projects. I'd love to check it out if you've created anything cool this year so you can uh, leave it in the comment below or uh, yeah maybe send me an email or whatever do whatever you want. Anyways hope you enjoyed this video and uh, see you next year probably. Okay